All night the boy has kept me lucid. I sat when I was at the very edge of despair, when I thought I would never unlock the secret of the island. I sat at the edge and I watched the idiot boy blink through the night. He's mute and he's retarded and he has no thought in his metal head but to blink each wave and each minute aside until the morning comes and renders him blind as well as deaf mute. In many ways, we have much in common. Listen, you can just barely hear the bell. Hear it? Hey, listen, listen. Well, I can hear it. I could totally live on this island. I'm just rummaging. Rummaging and coke. Okay, see so here's... Here's where all the luminous paint's coming from. See? I think. Boxes. Crates full of it. Okay, let's see what it says here. Neither did he eat nor drink. There must be a hole in the bottom of the boat. How else could new hermits have arrived? By taxi. So this is um, Source, and uh, I keep expecting um, head crabs to jump out at me. I had kidney stones and you visited me in the hospital. After the operation, when I was still half submerged in anesthetic, your outline and your speech both blurred. Now my stones have grown into an island and made their escape and you have been rendered opaque by the car of a drunk. So you can't... You can't really die in this game. In fact, you can't die, <laughs> to my knowledge. But I will show you what you can do. Check this out. When I first looked into the shaft, I swear I felt the stones in my stomach shift in recognition. Gnarly, huh? It's big. Um, okay, here we go. Yippee! Wow! Come back. It was all but a dream. Just put us on the other side of it. See? 
You don't have to fall in, by the way. I just fell in to show you what happens. It's not like it's part of the game or anything. Well, not really a game, maybe more of a story. Okay, here we go. Begun to climb, away from the sea and towards the center. It is a straight line to the summit, where the evening begins to coil around the aerial and squeeze the signals into early silence. The Bothy squats against the mount to avoid the gaze of the aerial. I too will creep under the island like an animal and approach it from the northern shore. Syringes. Uh, looks like Sherlock Holmes been here. Those are among the things that'll change every time you play it. constructed originally in the early 1700s. By then, shepherding had formalized into a career. The first habitual shepherd was a man called Jacobson from a lineage of migratory Scandinavians. He was not considered a man of breeding by the mainlanders. He came here every summer whilst building the Bothy, hoping eventually that becoming a man of property would secure him a wife and a lineage. Donnelly records that it did not. He caught some disease from his malcontented goats and died two years after completing it. There was no one to carve white lines into the cliff for him either. Or snort uh, white lines off of somebody's hips. That's a horrible thing to say. Shut up, Caleb. You're ruining this gorgeous game. Sorry, sorry. Inventory. A trestle table we spread wallpaper on in our first home. A folding chair I laughed at you for bringing...